and the kinds of sentences. How to change sentence one from to and the from form we came to know. So now friends what we have? Now we have the use of nouns. The grammar part the second unit what we have? We have the use of nouns. The use of nouns. Let us see what is the use of nouns. So in nouns we can see it as singular and plural. We can see nouns as singular and plural. So students what does it mean by singular and what does it mean by plural? Singular and then you know plural and then the end. So what does it mean by singular? Singular it means there is a one thing or the noun should be one, one in number. What does it mean by plural? Plural in the sense there is more than one thing. So there is more than one thing is known as a plural. So friends what does it mean by singular? The noun should be one. If it is one that means it is singular. If it is more than one it means it is plural. The students we came to know about the singular and plurals. Yes there are so many nouns are there in English and in languages. In it we can see it is singular and plural forms of the words nouns. So most of the singular nouns while doing the plural forms of the singular nouns what they do most of the words they take most of, most of the nouns they while doing the plural they take s yes form while doing the plural of the singular noun they what they do most of the words they take they takes s form to form the plural verb okay students first we will we will know what does it mean by singular and what does it mean by plural okay students here we have singular nouns and plural nouns what does it mean by singular noun and what does it mean by plural noun so singular means singular nouns refer to one person or thing singular nouns means it refers it refers to one person or one thing there should be the noun it should be a person or a thing there should be only one not more than one if there is more than one person or one thing so that noun is known as a plural noun see here plural nouns refer to more than one person or thing more than if there is more than one person or one one person or more than one thing that that noun is referred as a plural noun so students we came to know what does it mean by singular and what does it mean by plural okay students now how to make the plurals of singular nouns so how to make the plurals of singular nouns yes students how to make in the sense most we have in language we have so many nouns in language we have so many nouns while doing the while doing the plurals of the singular nouns most of the words what they day do most of the words most of the nouns they take s form to form the they take s form to form the plural of the singular noun so how to make the singular just see most of the words see friends most of the words what they do they take yes form to form the plural of the singular noun so write it down take the point take the point that most of the most nouns form most noun forms Plurals. So most of the words what they do, they take 
S form while doing plural. See for example. See here example. Yes, sorry, yes, double S, C, H, 
the plural okay students we came to know how to form the plurals the word ended with s double s x ch and sh what we have to do we have to add es to make the plural so we came to know so there are no uh, the in the language there is not only the word ended with s or es or x or double s or ch or sh there are so many words they end with the different letters so what to do for those letters yes let us see if the word is ended with the y and before the last letter y it it has a consonant if it has a consonant consonant plus y if it had the word it had the consonant plus y letter then what we have to do while doing the plural yes students while while doing the plural what we have to do in the sentence we have to add ies in the place of y so students let us take it up so take it up see students if the word the noun it ended with the it ended in the word in a consonant plus y so before the end of the word with the y the letter y what it should do have if the word it has a consonant and consonant letter and then the y letter so what to do when it is consonant plus y so if the word it ended in consonant plus y what we have to do we have to add Duty, duties. You have to write all the 
example cinema drama partition so i am not going to i am not giving uh, all the words just what you have to do you have to write it down in your box okay students see here duty duties baby babies pony ponies reply replies army armies family families country countries see all the words given are they are ended with the letter consonant plus y so for that what we did while doing the plural we added i e d s in the place of y okay stretch we came to know how to do plurals verb which word which noun it ended with the consonant plus y so let us move next time okay let us move okay students if the word we came to know if the word it ended with y and then before the y we put to if it to the word it is a consonant the letter if it is a consonant what we have to do we have to add i e s in the instead of y so if the word it has vowel plus y ending if the word it end in a vowel plus y then how to form the plural yes students if the word it end with vowel plus y then what we have to do we have to add s to make the plural see for example
Why? So the let the word is related to the capital. Why making the plural of why? So what we do? We add V E S in the place of capital. See. Remove the capital and add V E S. Why? I'll 
ओके स्टूडेंट्स नेक्स्ट क्लास वी विल स्टडी फर्दर सिमिलर साइन प्लूरल्स ओके स्टूडेंट्स टिल दिस टुडे दिस मच इज इनफ टुमारो वी विल स्टडी फर्दर सिमिलर साइन प्लूरल्स ओके स्टूडेंट्स राइट इट डाउन